Welcome to the project demonstration of uh, IoT based uh, shopping trolley by using Raspberry Pi based on image processing. So here we are using Raspberry Pi 3 B Blaze version uh, to read the images from this Pi camera and if that particular image consists of the database of objects is the product stored inside that uh, Raspberry Pi memory card then uh, if it is showing the first time when we are placing the switch in add mode then the product will be added to the cart and the total bill will be displayed on the LCD screen along with product name initially and for adding the product the beep will uh, provide the alerts for 300 milliseconds and when we are uh, removing the same product then it will go over the one second duration beeping as indication of the product was removed from the cart and the total bill also will be displayed on the LCD screen along with that in this version we have added the IOD feature so we can see the what are the products at which time it was added or it was removed and the total bill also will be displayed on the LCD screen so when we switch on the kit then this so called uh, data will be erased and will come for the zero onwards so then onwards we can show the products in front of the camera and then it will add it to that so here we are using Raspberry Pi 3 B Plus with a memory card of 32 GB class 10 so initially we need to load the Raspbian OS, uh, OS and then after we need to load the respective modules like OpenCV and uh, image processing modules and after that we need to store the these products images in database and the system when we run the code the system will capture the image and it will check with the product was present in the particular image or not if it is there then based on the selection of this switch whether it is add or remove will be done by the raspberry pi 3 b plus module for every action there is a audible alert from the buzzer and visual alerts on the lcd screen so we have interface the pi camera at the pi camera slot and switch is connected at the pin number 3 and buzzer at pin number 13 and LCD at pin number 9, 10, 11 and 17, 27, 22. So these are the main input and output connections of our projects. So for demonstration purpose we have loaded the, these three six pro, these uh, six products inside the Raspberry Pi 3 and uh, let us see demonstration before uh, on the power supply to that the very first step is we need to enable the hotspot in your phone as the card should connect it to the local area network. So for that, for the demonstration, we play. We need to place the uh, network name should be project five seven double four without any space, without any capital letter, and password should be one two three four five six seven eight nine, and band should be two point four gigahertz. These three settings are very important. Check twice before on the hotspot. After successfully configuration, you can on the power supply to the Raspberry Pi. Then wait around twenty to thirty seconds duration lets the raspberry pi boot into the memory card operating system as we know that when we switch on the laptop so it will take some time to boot into the os same thing happened here also it will take some time to boot into the os and uh, successfully booting then we can see the welcome message on the lcd screen right and buzzer on and off two times now the mode is add mode and total bill is zero and we kept the switch in add mode so you can see the raspberry pi got connected in your mobile phone so copy this IP address 192.168.26.3h and go to Google Chrome. Just copy and paste the same IP address along with colon 5000 ending. Right. So this is the main settings we need to enter. After the ending these settings, just click on that. Okay. You can see the previous data got erased only the time at which the card got switched on. And now so let us show the product there you can see the camera light on nothing but it's capturing the image and after that it will process if there is no image found the product product found then again to keep on capturing that so now i place the object in front of the camera now the robotic charger added okay and the next adapter so adapter got added so you can just refresh the screen we can see the total bill after adding the products. Place the object at a distance of 1 feet. Right. So now we can see the total 5550 bill. See, 5550 bill was added. Now let us remove these products. Sorry. 
So, if anything goes wrong while we are uh, demonstrating, it will show you the please restart. So then we need to switch off the power supply and on it again. From starting onwards, we need to demonstrate the project. Again, adding up the product. The main thing is we are not supposed to like we need to add the product. Keep that in add mode. So while demonstration, we know we are not supposed to block the camera vision. When we are getting the blocking vision for the camera, then it will take into the uh, please restart mode as there is no proper image was captured by the camera. See the product details at which time the product added. Now let us remove the products. Right, so now we can see that total product we are removed and added. So in this manner we made this project for easy uh, shopping purpose along with the building details also.